ಶ್ರೀ ಗುರುಭ್ಯೋ ನಮಃ ನಮಸ್ತೆ ಫ್ರೆಂಡ್ಸ್ ಥ್ಯಾಂಕ್ಸ್ ಥ್ಯಾಂಕ್ಸ್ ಫಾರ್ ಟ್ಯೂನಿಂಗ್ ಇನ್ ಟು ಅನದ ವೀಡಿಯೋ ಇನ್ ದಿಸ್ ಚಾನಲ್ ಟುಡೇ ಐ ವಿಶ್ ಟು ಪ್ರೆಸೆಂಟ್ ಯು ಅನ್ ಎಕ್ಸಲ್ ಫೈಲ್ ಫಾರ್ ಪರಿವರ್ತನ್ ಇನ್ಫ್ಯಾಕ್ಟ್ ಐ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಡನ್ ಎ ತಮಿಳ್ ವೀಡಿಯೋ ಜಸ್ಟ್ ಬಿಫೋರ್ ದಿಸ್ ಆನ್ ದ ಸೇಮ್ ಟಾಪಿಕ್ ಐ ಥಾಟ್ ಐ ವುಡ್ ಪ್ರೆಸೆಂಟ್ ದಿ ಇಂಗ್ಲೀಷ್ ವರ್ಷನ್ ಟುಡೇ ವಾಟ್ ಎಕ್ಸಾಕ್ಟ್ಲಿ ಇಸ್ ಪರಿವರ್ತನ್ ಸಿ ಪರಿವರ್ತನ್ ಈಸ್ ಅ ಮ್ಯೂಚುವಲ್ ಎಕ್ಸ್ಚೇಂಜ್ ಇಟ್ ಕುಡ್ ಬಿ ಎಕ್ಸ್ಚೇಂಜ್ ಆಫ್ ರಾಸೀಸ್ ಇಟ್ ಕುಡ್ ಬಿ ಎಕ್ಸ್ಚೇಂಜ್ ಆಫ್ ಈವನ್ ನಕ್ಷತ್ರಾಸ್ ಸೊ ದೆರ್ ಆರ್ ಡಿಫ್ರೆಂಟ್ ಐ ಮೀನ್ ದ ಲಾರ್ಡ್ಶಿಪ್ ಕುಡ್ ಬಿ ಡಿಫ್ರೆಂಟ್ ದ ಕುಡ್ ಬಿ ಇಟ್ ಕುಡ್ ಬಿ ಎ ಗುಡ್ ಪರಿವರ್ತನ್ ಆರ್ ಎ ಬ್ಯಾಡ್ ಪರಿವರ್ತನ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಇಟ್ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ಸಮ್ ರಿಮಾರ್ಕಬಲ್ ಎಫೆಕ್ಟ್ಸ್ ಬಿಕಾಸ್ ಪರಿವರ್ತನ್ ಮೈಟ್ ನಾಟ್ ಬಿ ವೆರಿ ಈಸಿ ಫಾರ್ ಅಸ್ ಟು ಇಮಿಡಿಯೇಟ್ಲಿ ಗ್ರಾಸ್ಪ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಮೆನಿ ಪೀಪಲ್ ಮಿಸ್ reading parivartan on a straight away note if you just see the chart uh, sometimes it's very clear uh, it's a somewhat uh, a little difficult for us to grasp from the north indian chart i would think because it's more focused on bhavas and kendras the folk, uh, whereas in the yeah, south indian chart you have that advantage because it's rashi based and the rashi parivartan can be easily identified but even then uh, it's not very obvious immediately and uh, we tend to not read it properly and uh, we miss on certain things we make some predictions without uh, taking into account that there has be there is parivartan especially nakshatra parivartan would not be very obvious at all uh, so i thought a tool would be useful in such cases for us to definitely identify parivartan in this i have the grahas the degrees of the grahas coming from formulas and it identifies which are the planets basically it highlights which are the planets that get into rashi parivartan and when you say rashi parivartan here i have taken swami sivananda's chart and you see moon and mars have undergone parivartan that means moon is in the rashi of mars uh, if you see moon is in mesham and mars is in karkataka there is a parivartan Uh, moon is in mars's rashi mars in moon's rashi so that parivartan once you see it is obvious but in the north indian chart it's a little more difficult for us to read that uh, once you see here uh, what is the effect of parivartan then once we identify and get it highlighted we can identify what has gone back in the background of this see if you see is mars seems to be weak here afflicted by saturn and rahu and his mars is uh, debilitated looks like but it's in a kendra it's in the lagna itself so you might say it's a, uh, there is a niche banga raja yoga so all that are there but if because of parivartan it is all the more strong it is as if mars is in the 10th house and is extremely in its own house and moon is in her own house uh, because of parivartan so moon as if you can place moon here and mars there and both become extremely strong and moon being in his own house would represent he is a man of compassion he is a man of love so all that i mean he was a very powerful gymnast he was ex- extremely active person as in a, even in the younger days i just pulled out uh, from wikipedia he when you see here he was born in pattamada near tirunelveli he he had a change of name see he was called kupu sami Uh, in his younger days since he later became a sanyasin his name uh, was changed and he became sivananda saraswati so that name change also is a parivartan so things like these things uh, which are uh, rashi parivartan bring explicit changes the focus itself shifts in fact he was uh, he was a powerful person practicing medicine in malaya and uh, suddenly there was a change in his life so all that can be attributed to sudden changes can be attributed to parivartan in fact uh, he he was a good student and he was a great founder of many institutions right he founded the divine life society the yoga vedanta academy so foundation is always the fourth house and he has the divine jupiter there and it is as if uh, mars is aspecting that jupiter so the foundation needs the energy vitality even here mars is aspecting even if it were here it is showing the fourth house aspect and here it is go if it be here it is would be for, with the seventh house aspect so that foundation ability came from mars i would think strongly 
uh, whether it be parivartan or now parivartan it's still but uh, being from here it is uh, it is one house so strength wise it's in the kendra house so that would be stronger i would think even here it's a kendra house but uh, yeah it's a watery sign whereas here it is his own house and it's a fiery sign and the fiery element was so obvious in swami sivananda ji and he was a author of so many yeah literature by so many books he entirely shifted the world focus to yoga so that again i would think from mercury the third house of writing uh, is divine jupiter because he wrote so many books on uh, yoga so this house was extremely strong because of that the uh, it might appear that the lord of this house is uh, weak uh, because venus is nicha but it's in the third house again of uh, uh, basically documenting things uh, putting things in writing and all that uh, but again there is a parivartan if you see moon as a parivartan with venus moon is the planet of action because it's a lagna lord itself his whole aim would be based upon moon and uh, there is a parivartan with venus venus the third lord from mercury is uh, basically compassion love all that would come from uh, in, through his documentation also so i would think uh, the excellent parivartan between the uh, these are lord of uh, uh, moon you see if you see moon moon is the lord of lagna and if you see mars uh mars cannot be lord of the fourth house there is something uh, amiss here let me see maybe bhava wise because uh, i think this uh, turns out to be the fourth bhava as per uh, my reckoning of bhavas i assume fourth bhava is starting at uh, 210 degrees uh, here uh, the first bhava is the ruled by moon the second by surya uh, this is the placidus of stisha so the, that's why uh, the fourth bhava happens to be that of uh, mars here uh, because it has crossed just to 210 degrees so that is i mean you can uh, i have erected it based upon the placidus of stisha and krishnamurti paddhati is uh, kp straight line ayamsa but if you want you can change the code inside and uh, modify it for the bhavas but you can verify Uh, whatever it is i i am making it as per the bhava or uh, uh, i am calculating here so that way uh, mars is in lagna saturn is in lagna rahu is in lagna jupiter in the fourth uh, so lordship is uh, changing because of just uh, 210 degrees just inside here because in krishna murti the bhava starts from the kaspal point of the bhava itself so those differences are coming out so this tool is uh, definitely useful to you you can check whether uh, let us see if you want to pull out another chart you just click here this is mg ramachandran the chief minister ex uh, chief minister of uh, tamil nadu he, he doesn't seem to have any rashi parivartan but he has uh, jupiter and ketu parivartan jupiter is in the star of ashwini ketu star here and ashwini ketu is in punarvasu the beautiful star of uh, so those things are coming out uh, very nicely here more of a nakshatra parivartan is more internal we can make out easily the deeper insights from it uh, unless we know the person th- he himself would know what the parivartan has caused to him it might not be very explicit uh, for others to get to know even if, if he be a celebrity so that uh, aspect it uh, we can't read much from the rashi because there is no rashi parivartan here so let us go to swami chandrashekhar saraswati uh, obviously when you see here do we immediately read a parivartan we might not uh, but when you see the chart jupiter and venus have parivartan uh, jupiter is in the 10th house the 8th lord in the 10th the 10th lord in the 8th the, for a sanyasi for a person in the uh, Uh, spiritual life eighth is a very good house and uh, it is as if jupiter is in his own house with rahu and venus is in her own house in the 10th uh, so that effect there is a parivartan between the fifth and the eighth lord which is jupiter and the third and the 10th lord which is uh, venus so you can make uh, readings based upon the bhava lord shapes and the nature of the planets so the and the nature he thinks that uh, went on in his life so this tool would be that way useful to you this is 
डॉक्टर राजेंद्र प्रसाद प्रेसिडेंट एक्स प्रेसिडेंट ऑफ इंडिया यस नक्षत्र परिवर्तन सो दिस इज के बी सुंदर ग्रेट सिंगर ऑफ द पास्ट इन द सीनी सिंगर एज वेल स्पिरिचुअल सिंगर इन द तमिलनाडु एरिना दिस इज रामलिंग राजू सो श्री रामलिंग राजू इज ई एस ए नक्षत्र परिवर्तन बिटवीन वीनस and you know venus and rahu and he was a financial it got caught in financial fraud and all that rahu brings the fraudulent nature venus the financial aspects and there is a parivartan between the those two planets we have uh, this is bharati dasan the great poet uh, from tamil nadu and he has a venus a planet of poetry parivartan with saturn and his uh, poems were uh, in a way very poignant and deep rooted so saturn's elements are Wire brought in there, so let's uh, get into. Uh, I mean, uh, so this is Tejas V Surya, yes, Parivartan of Mars, the planet of fiery nature, with the Venus for him, the second and the seventh lot. So we have to interpret that. So uh, Priyanka Gandhi, she has a Venus and Saturn in Parivartan. So uh, that you will have to interpret. So uh, the fifth lot with the ninth lot. So that's spiritually good. the 12th lord with the 9th lord and the 8th lord is also involved there uh, saturn becomes the 8th lord so there is a parivartan there yeah uh, there is a no marriage case this is chuba subhash chandra bose he has only nakshatra parivartan i this is alu prasad yadav this is actress padmini of the past uh, tamil films so she has a mercury parivartan with venus and you see mercury and venus for her case she as uh, the sec is, is as if uh, mercury is in the second house in its own house and venus in, is in her own house in the first house and she was very beautiful she was uh, eloquent uh, she expressed herself very nicely so all that can come as if mercury is in the second and the venus brings in beauty being in the first house so uh, this is uh, janaki another uh, singer of the tamil arena this is ex president of india r venkatraman this is mars powerfully exchanging with the venus here the venus is the third and the 10th lord of karma lord exchanging with fairy planet mars the mars is in the house of venus and venus is in the house of mars so this is yer ragman this is tm saundar rajan and the singer of the tamil arena so this is jayalalitha jayaraman she as uh, ex chief minister of uh, tamil nadu she as uh, Jupiter exchanging with Ketu in nakshatra parivartan and Ketu is in the fifth house it is as if Ketu is in the seventh and Jupiter is in the fifth I mean uh, I mean nakshatra parivartan you don't have to shift the rashis you can think of as if Jupiter is carrying the effect of uh, Ketu so she was denied a child uh, her marriage was in doldrums uh, she never married so as if Ketu is in the seventh I mean we can infer a seventh lord is afflicted by Ketu so that is not obvious immediately but we from the chart so this is uh, okay rajinikanth he has a powerful parivartan of uh, jupiter and rahu both in rashi parivartan and in, i forgot to tell you this rashi column parivartan is based upon uh, i would say gemini's uh, uh, allotment of scorpio as a planet as a house for uh, ketu and uh, aquarius as a house for rahu so in case uh, rahu ketu are uh, exchanging i use this column so in this case jupiter is sitting in rahu's house and rahu is sitting in jupiter's house so that way there is a parivartan here uh, and also rahu is in purva bhadra which is jupiter's nakshatra and jupiter is in uh, i think satha bishak which is the nakshatra of rahu so therefore it's a nakshatra parivartan and uh, rashi parivartan of the same planets and he rose to great heights in a sudden manner and that comes in because of the eighth of suddenness where jupiter the eighth lord would be sitting in its own house because of the parivartan and uh, became element of rahu also brings in suddenness so we know he had a change of name also so all these sudden changes and all things in life uh, bringing upliftment is uh, because of the eighth house effect i would think and that of rahu as well and the beautiful parivartan yes between jupiter and rahu so let us see this is another uh, ex uh, yeah rajagopalachari or uh, uh, 
the first uh, president of india the you see uh yes uh, multiple parivartans mars yes uh, mars is in venus house and venus is in mars house so the third and fourth lord uh, and you see jupiter is in parivartan so jupiter in saturn's house and saturn is in jupiter's house so he, 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 jupiter is nietzsche and uh, since it has exchange place with saturn also he i think he was uh, his practice of uh, maybe changed his uh, practice got into politics uh, and he was maybe uh, jupiter as a lawyer he did not continue as in that profession being the eighth lord and exchange with saturn uh, was a negative thing in that uh, field perhaps so that's uh, this is pure chinappa this is uh, ilai rajas indra gandhi's chart is uh, exceptional in uh, terms of parivartan if you see so many greens here ultimately she I mean parivartan takes you to great heights because both the planets be, uh, become in their own house it is as if uh, see moon is shifting here with saturn so uh, it is as if saturn is in his own house and moon is in her own house so both uh, become extremely strong moon and saturn yeah when of course it is also negative in many sense because uh, for the husband it will be the uh, yeah the it will be challenging the seventh lord is connected all that and she has uh, mars in surya house and surya in mars house so it is as if the power of uh, surya it is as if surya is in his own house and mars in his own house so that also an extremely powerful parivartan it's not that always parivartan is good sometimes parivartan can be extremely bad as well depends upon the lordship of the houses and what it carries on but all that you can I mean, just seeing the chart, you might not identify, but when you see the green ones, you know. And Venus and Saturn, uh, not Venus and Saturn, Venus and Mars, and Jupiter. Uh, Jupiter is in Venus house, and Venus is in Jupiter's house. That again, as if Jupiter were in his own house, uh, which is the sixth house of enemies, and Venus, the eleventh, Badaka, would be quite strong in the Badaka stan. would also be troublesome and jupiter as if joining with rahu is a bad for the uh, karagatvas of the children who both died in miserable circumstances so in our case multiple parivartans there is also parivartan of mercury with ketu you see ketu shows mercury is there and in mercury shows ketu is there so it is as if you bring ketu here so he becomes very strong and you take mercury there you also become strong as the 12th lord which gives lot of losses as well and uh, it since is the 5th lord going to the 12th loss of children so she has multiple nakshatra parivartans also I mean you can read uh, in detail multiple things from these charts i hope this tool is useful to you uh, put it to use i will place it in the downloadable link uh, yeah may you uh, reap benefits from it and this is the first time i am giving the uh bhava chart as per uh, north indian style hope uh, there is no mistake you just uh, verify uh, yeah give me in the comment section if this is a useful tool and also suggestions for such tools in the coming days thank you very much